Hello everyone. Welcome back to another session of lesson 2 Socialism in Europe and the Russian Revolution. Today we will study about the revolution of October 1917. The revolution of October 1917. As the conflict between the provisional government and the Bolshevik grew, Lenin feared the provisional government would set up a dictatorship. In September, he began discussing for an uprising against the government. Bolshevik supporters in the army, Soviets and factories were brought together. On 16th October 1917, Lenin persuaded the Petrograd Soviet and the Bolshevik party to agree to a socialist seizure of power. A military revolutionary committee was appointed by the Soviet under Leon Trotsky to organize the seizure. The date of the event was kept a secret. The uprising began on 24th October. Sensing trouble, Prime Minister Kerensky had left the city to summon troops. At dawn, military men loyal to the government seized the building of two Bolshevik newspapers. Pro-government troops were sent to take over telephones and telegraph offices and protect the Winter Palace. In a swift response, the Military Revolutionary Committee ordered its supporters to seize government offices and arrest ministers. Late in the day, the ship Aurora shelled the Winter Palace. Other vessels sailed down the Neva and took over various military points. By nightfall, the city was under the committee's control and the ministers had surrendered. At a meeting of all the Russian Congress of Soviet in Petrograd, the majority approved the Bolshevik action. Uprising took place in other cities. There was heavy fighting, especially in Moscow. But by December, the Bolshevik controlled the Moscow Petrograd area. Students, I hope you all have understood this much. We will continue this lesson in my next video. Thanks for watching.